Hi, today I'm going to show you how to change units used for margin measurements. Microsoft Word allows you to modify your work environment extensively. And one of the changes you can make involves the default units of measurement used in a dialog box and on the ruler. By default, Microsoft Word uses inches, but you can customize the program so it will use centimeters, millimeters, points, and pickers. But you have to know that this change also affects the ruler and other measurements. So with this explanation, I'm going to show you how you can customize your program so that you can use centimeter, millimeter, inches, depending on which measurement units do you want to use. Now, by default, as you can see, for my case, I have uh, inches. But now, how to change inches to centimeter? Now you go to File, you click on File, and then you go to Options, and then the dialog box Word option, the Word option dialog box will open. And then click on Advanced. And then scroll down up to Show Measurement in Units of Inches. You see the option now is Inches, but you have the down arrow, means you have several options. Now click on the down arrow. You will see other options. You see centimeters, millimeters, points and pickers. Now let's choose centimeters because we already have the inches. Click on centimeters and at the bottom of the dialog box, click OK. Now view the ruler on your Microsoft Word. Now it shows the, the measurements are in centimeter. Now let's go back and change it to, uh, to, to millimeter, one more option. So the same procedure, now go to File, click on Option, the dialog box will pop up, and then go to Advanced, and the scroll down up to where you see Show Measurement in Unit of. We have centimeter, but now we want to change it into millimeter. Click on millimeter and click OK. Now you see our measurement had changed to millimeter. But let's go back and set it to inches. Then we click on advanced and then we scroll down. We change from millimeter back to inches and click OK. Now my program is reading using inches. For this case, I'm using Microsoft Office 2016 but for other version, you can still follow the same procedure to change the user means to suit your needs. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.